Hey, what's up everyone? This is Jim Labuda here once again. And today we're gonna to take a look at the golf swing of Akshay Batia. Akshay picked up the win at their Barracuda Championship this past weekend for his first victory in the PGA Tour. He's known as a very, very powerful player, believes in really bombing the golf ball down the fairway. So let's go ahead and take a look at his driver swing here. A couple things we're gonna point out. Number one, take a look at a setup, really, really big wide base there. He's gonna make a real powerful swing around the ball. Arms are nice hanging down naturally, but you can see his head here. It's got a little bit of a turn to it, almost like he's looking at it, almost out of that lead eye a little bit more. As he starts taking the golf club away, a couple things to point out here. Again, we get here, real big rotation. Those arms are really, really extended. That trail arm is not starting to bend, kind of like we saw in British Open winner Brian Harmon's swing. His trail arm has a tendency to bend real early in the golf swing. You can see here with Akshay, he's really keeping that arm nice and level, really creating a lot of width there. As he gets to the top of his swing, I mean, I'm going to go ahead and stop it up here. Let's just talk about these amazing positions here. I mean, I'm going to go ahead and say it, to be young and flexible and this mobile again would just be amazing. You look at the hip turn there that he's got full shoulder turn, but really the big thing I see here is he's still got both feet level on, even on the ground there. A lot of times at this point, due to inflexibility or lack of mobility, a lot of people are kind of picking up this lead hip or this lead foot to allow that hip turn. You can see here he doesn't do that. He's able to keep both feet on the ground. But as he starts his downswing here, we're really gonna focus on the lower body because he uses his lower body really well in the golf swing. This is the squat move for power that everybody talks about. He starts going with that lower body, that right hip starts opening first. And you can see as he starts getting an impact here, if we start focusing on this trail knee, we're gonna watch how he really pushes hard off that trail side and look at that amount of lag that he's creating here. The lag is just amazing. And again, that lag is a product of his weight shift and his hip turn amazing, amazing positions to be in. And this is where he gets all his power in his golf swing. Now, as he starts coming to impact here, you can see that lead knee. Look at that thing. That thing is still staying bent. So now as he gets really close to impact, now you can see how it's starting to straighten up. And that's where he's using the ground for leverage and creating all that force in the swing. But again, as he's doing this, if you watch the knee here and the trail knee, that's still driving towards the golf ball, but then it does come a point where it does stop. So his lower body almost slows down a little bit more. The hips really kind of stop opening. And then as he gets into impact, you can see that the right leg is really, really straight up. He's pushed off the ground. Left knee has gotten a really close to the golf ball. So there's a lot of hip rotation coming in there, but this impact position, with the arm, driver, that is a perfect, perfect impact position to be in. Real solid position here. So he's a very, very powerful golfer. I think we're going to hear a lot from Akshay in the upcoming months and years. Young player, a young American golfer, very powerful, similar to like a Justin Thomas build here where he's very, very skinny, very, not, it doesn't weigh a lot. I think he's only like 140, 150 pounds, but yet one of the most powerful golf swings on tour because he really knows how to use that ground for leverage. And he's really, really able to drive the golf ball a long way down the fairway. So let's see what we can see out of the, hopefully we'll get more out of this young American golfer in the upcoming months and years. But I think we're going to see a lot more of Akshay Badia coming up soon.